So this is Zucosis. Um, I've seen a few things on it, and to start out, October, my favorite month, I figure um, playing some of this would be fun. Alright, so let's see how this is. Are you sure you want to start a new game? I haven't played this. So, don't know why I would suggest that. This is my first day. I'm excited to start a new job. Being a zookeeper and taking care of the animals, or I guess they take care of me. Before we begin, I want you to put down your scribble. Okay. Um, press here to sign. Wait. I gotta read. You don't sign something without knowing what you're signing. Um, any information attained by the night to keep her during this appointment is considered confidential. The night to keep her undertakes not to disclose confidential information to third parties. In the event of injury or death of the night to keep her while performing work duties, the employer is not liable to the relatives or other lawful representatives. Okay, that's fair. Um, effective upon signing and is considered indefinite. Okay. The night keeper or lawful representatives agree not to involve the police. Okay. Let's not waste time here. You'll be sitting here all night and I've got more important things to attend to. Right, right. I get it. I'm, you know, I'm just reading to, yeah. Um, any changes to the agreement written? Okay. Press here. That, that's my... Excellent. Sure. You made the right move. Just a couple more things and you'll pull your family out of poverty. I really hope so. Attach this to your chest. Our scientists require us to do this to see everything that happens in the enclosures. Scientists? I thought this was a zoo. True. Never thought that the smart Alex belong right in the zoo. <laughs> Hope you got the joke. Excellent. Now let's get started. First, grab your personal PDA. It's necessary for interacting with all the work objects. Congratulations, you've taken the first step to becoming a part of our close-knit zoo family. Hi. Wait, what's this for? Well, He'll find out later. Uh, is this part of the interview process? I've been to a, a couple interviews, and this one's going a little different than the one. I'm sure it's fine. Oh, Just, are you finally awake? I haven't had Good, a... get up. Okay. It's time to get to work. What the hell? What did you do to me? I took care of your health. Working with animals requires prevention. You wouldn't want to bring some kind of infection home, would you? By the way, I took your phone as well. I'll return it in the morning after oh, the shift. Oh, now I can't play Pokemon Go. So I got the job? I thought we had an interview. My wife is waiting for me outside. The job will be yours if you make it through the night. Let's go. I still have a lot to show you. Okay. Did I pass the interview? You gonna eat that? Can I, can I ask? Okay. It's probably not wanting me to. You need to work on your mirrors. They, uh, oh, gross. God, I hate bathrooms in general, but that's awful. A locker. He didn't write. Oh. Oh. Can I have his box head? Yeah, let's... I've 
enraged even more waiting for you here. You'll be fine, you'll be fine. I'm just looking around, doing a big look to see. Quite spacious here. Yep, this is our hub. Yep. You'll have plenty of everything here, except time. Now we're in the cold room. Here we store herbs, vegetables, and fish oh, while the meat gets that. ground into portions for the animal rations. And right now we're running low on herbs and vegetables. Got the hint? Get to it. You can find the instructions in oh, your PDA. Okay. So this uh, two herbal and one vegetable bricks into the brick trolley. Okay. Meats, fish, fur. I do have limits to my patience. Right. Most of the bricks will be left as a reserve. And take these ones with you. It's time to show you our workhorse. <laughs> What was that? There's something in the works that you're not ready to know about yet. Let's start with the basics. Okay. And here's our K-A-T-I-E, Kinetic Automated Transport with Innovative Engineering. Katie oh, will take you around the zoo. Oh. Right. Katie. This is the refrigeration compartment. You need right. to load the brick trolley here. Until you load it here, Katie won't budge. To load the brick trolley, you need to activate the lever. Aboard! Now, select the giraffe enclosure on the control panel and start the train. Come on, how much longer? Fast your seatbelts and sit up straight. Let's go. Uh, all right. Hold on here. Something, everything. Um, where do I sit? It's dark. Hey, can you turn on the lights? It's a little dark. It's a little dark in here. That's spooky. Don't be in my face. Please don't be in my face. Oh, I like jumped in front of you. So That's we're cool. at the giraffe station. Now listen carefully. I won't repeat it twice. Okay. This is our mobile veterinary station. Here you'll be mixing medications for Are our animals. Are they sick? Well, they can be. We need to closely monitor the health of the animals. We have some quite rare specimens, so the thought of anything happening to them is out of the question. Take this seriously, and we should all be safe for another day. Balance. Follow me. Balance. This is our kitchen factory. To collect feces for tests, you have to feed the animal its Wait. favorite food. Huh? Here's where you'll prepare it. Choose the recipe from the list. Cut, mix, and you're done. Any questions? Yes. Excellent. The <laughs> zoo needs those who aren't afraid to ask. But even more so, it needs those who find answers themselves. All right, enough chit-chat. Go to the cutting table. Okay. You need to select the giraffe from the list. Mm. Oh, that one. Press on the cook button to go to the slicing screen. Okay. Click on the cut, find the slice of herbs. Don't make a mistake with the weight. The exact measurement is displayed on the weight indicator. Measure okay. carefully. Okay. So that's probably half. Let's do like right there. Excellent, Paul. Cut. Now do the same with the herbal brick from the recipe. Go ahead. Okay, I need exactly half. Pretty close, pretty close. Perfect. Now activate the lever to lower the gadget trolley. All right, all right. Um, this. So now drag the trolley to the gates. 
this would be a cool thing in, like, Lethal Company. You know, like, bring things in and stuff like this. I'm like, oh. <laughs> sure, that's fine. Don't smile. I never thought a zoo could be organized like this. I don't like the way you're walking. Train? Can you stop walking Trolleys? like that? Yes, Paul, our zoo is quite... Uh, I do not trust this guy at all. I'm getting like a goosebumps already. Then why is Especially the zoo closed for the second year? I don't. People say the zoo is going through tough times. How would I know? I'm just a simple man. Clock in and clock out. How long have you been right. here? Long enough to teach you everything. Come on, move the trolley. And this is the entrance me, like, to the enclosure. To open the door, you need to insert your PDA um, into the enclosure terminal and select Open Enclosure. He has a good voice. It's just like, it gives me, um... Like, um, God, what? The one guy from Resident Evil 7, Jack Baker, Vibes, like the way he was walking. Okay, so we have Bo, we got Poe, and we got Cleo. Okay. Oh, there's a lot of things. Aggressive, hungry, dead, scared, sick. I don't think I'm looking dead. No. Now we need to feed our little creatures. Take the bucket and dump the food little? in the feeding area. L Wait, you said little Whoa. Hi, Cleo. Oh, hi. Hi, Bo. You're not happy. Okay, um... Oh, hi. Um, where's your food? Where do I drop the food? Okay, can you... I'm new here. Can you show me where the... Oh. Okay. Uh, Great. Now put on the MFE. What's that? Muff? Mobile Muff? fecal extractor. In simpler oh. terms, a shit sucker. You've eaten oh. shit before. <laughs> now oh. you're going to suck it. I don't know. Why do we need all this? We need to constantly monitor the health of the animals, and taking excrement for tests is one of your key tasks. A hundred thousand a year, Paul. A hundred thousand fucking American dollars. You just have to collect the shit. A shit sucker. Come on, Paul. Don't chicken out. Me. Okay. Let's go find some direct shit. Are you guys in a good mood? Anyone shit? Anyone shitting in here? I've seen a giraffe lay down. Hi. You're pretty. Pretty, but pretty. Hi, Bo. Did you shit anywhere? Oh, there's shit. And we're sucking. And we're sucking. Sorry, no, I'm not sharing. This is my draft shit. You can't have any. Alright, I think we need one more shit pile. Hey, Poe, did you shit? Oh, what's the timer? I don't like that timer. Let's 
see any more shit. Maybe that's it. So confused. I don't see. I wish there was like a thing to show you after a certain time, because I am so confused. Hello. Am I good? I feel like I'm like just messing you. Oh. TIS. To avoid unnecessary questions, it's a thermal imaging system. You can just call it a thermal imager. It's needed to determine the body temperature of our animals. Good. Now install it and measure the temperature of the giraffes. Alright, Cleo. Sage. 
trees. Oh, you're doing good. 38.7 bow. Wait, wait. Bow. Alright. Let's move the camera so I can get bow. Hi, bow. You're doing good. 1991. I was one year old. Then. And Bo is doing good. What do we have here? Bo, Cleo, where's Bo? Oh. Oh, laying down again. Oh, you're not. You're really warm. You okay? As you can see, one of the giraffes isn't doing well. We need to make a dart with That's Temperalax. Nice. It's a medication for normalizing the temperature of animals. By the way, okay. it was developed by one of the local eggheads. Interact with the terminal and press the exit and closure button. Okay. In the terminal, you can check all the analyses you've collected in this enclosure. Alright, take the trolley back. Do I have to make some medications, too? Well, you studied chemical technology in Indiana. You'll manage. Damn. How do you know all this? Trust me, it's not something worth being surprised about here. But I barely lasted six months there. Got kicked out of the first year. No worries. That should be enough to mix a couple of ingredients following a ready-made formula. <laughs> Walking any slower. Congratulations, Paul. You just come out. closer to success and the well being of your family. Now, go and load the collected fecal matter into the biomaterial receiver. You don't carry anything into the car, everything must be sterile. And don't forget to put the shit sucker back in place. so jumpy. Now you need to load the trolley into the train. To do this, press the lever inside the car. Oh, yeah, it's so funny. It's so funny. Look at that smile on your stupid face. Yeah, now you're not so happy, are you? Huh? Why do you look like that? Excellent. Now this is our mobile vet station. To make Temporalax, you need to load the station with enough vials. I did it this time, but in the future you'll have to gather the vials yourself to cook it up. But keep in mind, chum, there are not so many vials. Think twice before using them. Temporalax. Now take the dart from the dart dispenser. Cool, you've got Temporalax. Now load it into the veterinary gun. It's in the gadget trolley. Oh. Good. Now the only thing left is to dart the sick giraffe. Wait, I gotta shoot it? Judging by your face, not the best. Uh, I'm sorry, sir. It seems I missed. 
shit. Damn it, Paul, get it together. I asked you to take this task seriously. Money doesn't grow on trees, and all that's required of you is to follow the formula, make a dart, and shoot the animal in the rear. <sighs> Fine. I don't have any more time to deal with you. Everything you need to know, I've already shown you. Now we need to get back to the hub. Oh, but I want to shoot it. Not really, but... I want to learn. Okay, I can go back. Can I make another? We gotta heal the... I feel bad now. to the exit. It's time to leave you alone with our lovely zoo facilities. I'm gonna go back to the trash and Hopefully. Every zookeeper is entitled to a service car. This one's mine. If you perform well tonight, you'll get one in the morning. Is that your wife? Should I tell her you're staying here for the night? Keep in mind, I'll lock you in until morning. No problem. I think she'll figure it out and go home soon. As you wish. Good luck, Paul. Don't what? mess up. She's standing out in the rain. job are you in debt do you need money urgently increase vacancy the salary is a hundred thousand per year just left my paperwork sitting all right wife um good luck You entered here who knows how long ago. You're not answering calls. I'm worried. Lily, sweetheart. Sorry. Didn't hear you right away. Everything's okay. They put me on probation, but I had to start immediately. You should just go home. I'll be back in the morning and tell you everything. Paul, but I saw them lock you up. It's not normal. Yeah. It's just protocol here. They took away my phone and made me sign an NDA. And all I have to do is feed and treat the animals. Oh, and by the way, uh, there's plenty of meat here. I want my girls to finally eat normal food. I'll be right back. Don't go away.
kill you. You doing okay, Pooh? Night Zookeeper, Paul Connolly. Oh, thank God, finally. Uh, please don't hang up. I've been trying to reach my husband all day. He's a scientist, Clarence J. Summers. People usually call him CJ. I'm sorry, ma'am. I'm here alone. Please check for me. He should be in the lab. Uh, is there a lab here? Oh, I understand. You're new. Then, one last request. Someone Look in his locker audio. in the break room. Code 1768. Through, through the right, like Man, it's like spinning this around. Feel right. like, the Paul, I'm begging you. Around. CJ needs to take his medication regularly. I just want to make sure he has them with him. So just open weird. the locker. That's all. I'll call back. Yeah, I got a bunch of stuff. Why didn't he come up with this earlier? Show me this. Um, do I have to bring a cart? No. Alright, I need Poe. You Poe? Sorry, give me a name, I you? See that post. Okay. All right, guys. Have a good one. Zookeeper, Paul Connolly. I'm sorry, ma'am. I haven't had a chance to look around yet. What's with the ma'am? Oh, nothing. A woman called, looking for someone named CJ, searching for her husband. That bitch again. Although CJ is no saint either, always hanging around some girls, lying to his wife that he's in the lab, and we don't even have labs here. Anyway, forget it. Why am I calling you? There'll be a food delivery soon, and you need to grind some fresh meat. Got it? Yes, sir. Excellent. I'll call you later. Turn to the hub and activate the supply button.
Hello? Damn. I, I mean, Night Zookeeper, Paul Connolly. Don't worry, Paul. It's me again. How's it going? Do you need any explanations? Oh, uh, I definitely I got a couple. Do. I thought you had beef or, uh, I don't know, lamb in the fridge. And there... And there's a long neck pig. You see, Paul, dozens of parasites spread from the mother every day. They infiltrate our animals and they turn into... How shall I put it? Well, monsters. And they have specific tastes. They need meat. What the... What the hell is the mother? <laughs> Relax. The mother is securely locked away. Not much is known about her, so they study her. Forget about it. You know your tasks. Don't worry about the rest. Damn. I should have been warned about this in advance. I didn't sign up for this. Of course you did. You signed an NDA. <laughs> I've seen what happens to those who violate NDA. I advise you not to. So if they say grind bodies, you grind. If they say kill, you kill. Got it? Got it. And if by chance you want to tell someone about these little secrets, that would be a direct violation of the NDA. And you'll have to face the consequences of your actions. Now stop whining and get back to work. Night Zookeeper, Paul Connolly. Why so grim? Problems? Uh, what the hell is going on here? Fuck. I almost threw a live girl into the grinder. Where did she come from? Alive? Well, well. 20 mil of xylazine and she's still with us. But fortunately, this problem is easy to solve. Pull the drop lever and the girl will turn into a couple of bricks, just like you've dealt with before. Easy peasy. Fuck. I suspected this place wasn't clean, but uh, why else such big bucks? I can grind a couple of bodies, but I'm not going to get involved in crime and risk my family. Fuck you. Well, no one is asking you. In general. Look at your hands. What the hell is this? Did you poison me? Poison? <laughs> Who do you think I am? A desperate housewife? No, Paul. I infected you. And by the way, I did it for your own good. You see dozens of parasites spread out of the mother every day. They infiltrate our animals, and they transform, to put it mildly, well, let's say they mutate. What the hell is this damn mother? <laughs> Not much is known about her, so they study her. But right now, the same parasite is squirming inside you. And if you behave well, they'll take it out. And if not, who knows? Maybe it will be even better for Lily and Gina. Fuck! Hello again. Y'all come? Alright, well, you're taking a little nap, so. Uh, bye! Oh, did I just disappear? It's cold. It's warm. It's a lot less creamy. Excuse me, pardon me, coming through 88. Alright, um, let's go. What was the next thing I wanted to do? So I can do the Pengu one. I want to see the other ones. Let's see which one I'm supposed to do next. I guess I'll. I know the penguin was one. So I guess I'll do that. Fish.
Rebel. some penguins. I don't like how I feel backwards. That really freaks me out. Space for the effect of specimens in the kitchen factory. Feed them. Give them your access to our space for the effect of specimens in the kitchen factory. Okay. I'm an infected animal. the penguins. So we got Daisy, Luna, Coco, Tinker, Misty, and Rocky. Hey guys. Let's head on here. Let's go. Hungry? Oh, I didn't make your food yet. I'm sorry. Okay. I was trying to click. Okay. I'm going too fast. Get right back.
more boats here. Ah, this says you like it. Alright, everyone. Dig in. Uh, please don't leave. Yes, yes. You're a real one. Oh, you should too? Hell yeah. Where did you all go? You did great. That's everyone. Um, that's monitor. Just measure the sound. Submit pod for analysis. Submit feet assess for analysis. I don't think she was swimming and stuff. I think I got everyone. Mm-hmm. 
Check your blood. Oh, you did great. Okay, so I got Coco and Misty. Get Tinker. Coco, Misty, Tinker. Stop for a second. Here, yeah, try with your friend. Or not. For a second, just kind of check your blood. Already got you, Missy. You're good. So scary. Okay. So Rocky, oh, I didn't get the sound for Tinker. No, Rocky's voice isn't good. I need to do something for Rocky.
figure out what I can do for Rocky's forts. Six times, or I think I just has to do once. Right, what can I do for Pengu voice? Reduces ammo activity, inducing rel relaxations, breathe lethal injection, quick and painless euthanasia of animals in critical cases, use without a supervisor. Approval is prohibited. Temper relax. Acute respiratory viral infections. caused by salmonella bacteria resulting in symptoms like diarrhea, fever, and abdominal cramps. No, or, no it's this one. Yeah, the temperature's fine. Um, refers to infections caused by parasitic worms which can affect different organs. How do I fix See, I don't know which one to make. say parasitic worms that can affect. Okay, so anything that helps against worms?
I don't know what one. I don't know these terms. by parasitic worms. See, this is for infections. I'm trying to see what it says, like infections or something. Bacterial infections. Parasitic substance caused by. I think it's this. We're gonna try. Hopefully, we are right, Rocky. Get my dark gun. Reason. tranquilizer or do I lose this doesn't have approval is prohibited maybe I'll try and tranquilize it So maybe I do have to put it down. This it's still handle the mutant penguin. How do I rescue them? We just 
just try and put it down. to the hub and deal with it. I'm 
bounce back this. Sucker does anything for that? Because there was a thing for viruses on the uh, where I was causing the shit, so maybe. That thing's weird looking. I saw my teeth. Where are the veins on its neck? Okay. I shot one of them in. Um, I didn't have the shift bar. Did I miss anyone? Some stuff and then maybe go check out the gorilla. I'm sure that won't go bad at all. said there was another sh shipment. Alright, who's next? Oh, you're asleep. Cool. Experimental meds on maintained specimens. They don't work during the frustration phase. The pathological cell division process must be completed. In other words, the organism must fully mutate. Access to experimental drugs is located at the best station. any medicine for myself.
place. Okay, so for the bear. What do we need for bear? Bear needs or gorilla, not bear. Um one herb and two and a half kilograms of vegetable. Okay, so I just need one of the herb. I thought it was like when it said two, that was two blocks. Two points. Okay, so this is only one point five. some meat just in case because um in case one of the gorillas is not doing well. Okay. to the gorilla. So creepy. Okay. Gorilla. We can make it if we need it, kind of thing. Need only a pound. That's about 1.35, so like right. percent of 20 percent. Okay. So, feed our gorillas. Let's 
definitely wouldn't be scary at all. Definitely not freaked out about that. I don't know. Everything seems fine there. I know you guys are hungry. Give me a sec. found a way to cure that damn mutant with the uh, experimental meds. I found access on some CJ's PDA. Looks like he's an important dude around here. Gave the mutant an instruction of toxics, paralysis, and this shit really worked. Awesome news, and by the way, it seems mutants can mimic different diseases. I'll keep an eye out. Turn the meat and calm them down. Oh, so you don't need to kill them. That's interesting. See how awful this is going to be. Grab my bucket and my... Okay. Hey guys, food is here. We got Dexter, Pepper, Thor, and cheese. Okay. Hi. Guys. Can I come through really quick? I want to give you your food. Take pictures of this so they can hear them. 
Hi, Pepper. Can I come up here with you guys? Oh. That's how I... They wouldn't get upset about that at all. It's weird you can put things wherever you want. Okay. Hey, Chief. Mind if I. I'm not gonna inject you. Okay, you're fine about this. Thank you. Hey Thor, um, mind if I talk about her whole phone? Whoever wants to be for their son, I said. Okay. Excellent. Now you're gonna fall too. Alright, let's go. What did I get first? I get Pepper. I hope I didn't check or take peppers thing twice. Four I definitely needed. Assuming so, Chief. Oh, where am I? Oh, definitely. Good. Okay, I think I got everyone. I think I got someone twice. Let's see how we're going. Oh, 
Okay, so Pepper and Chief both have blood related issues. BSI. BSI is a condition where bacteria or other pathogens enter the bloodstream causing serious illness. So this would be this one? B-guard? Antimicrobial? Uh, microbial substance for the treatment of blood diseases. I guess. I'm gonna look at everything else, but... I think it might be B-guard. Be this mimicking blood diseases. There's so many. But you need animal blood. So I'm between B guard because it's a blood disease. It's a bacteria. It doesn't say anything about the blood. Try this. So confused.
like I'm sad. I was so scared of them. They were so nice. save them, one of the infected things come out.
Good morning, Paul. How was your night? It's time to feed the mother. Wake up, Paul. Mother likes her food to flutter and squeak. Don't worry about your wife. I think she'll make a great dessert. Really, Paul, you didn't think that after everything you've seen, I'd let you go? Uh-oh, looks like Mommy is particularly hungry today. Bye, Paul. Tell Mother. Bon appetit. <laughs> Couldn't save the journalist. He failed to warn Molly about the origin of the meat, and her visit with the meal made from it became fatal. Lily fell into Doc's trap, just like Paul. Both of them became food for his monster. Three young daughter Gina's left. I didn't read the last second sentence. So that's it. Oh, new animals available. Hippos. Ah, they're, they're, that's gonna be scary. Hippos are terrifying. Elephant. Aww. Okay, so that was uh, Zucosis. I did not get a good ending. <laughs> Um, yeah, I will do a part two later. That was actually a good time to end. Um, I still feel bad about Thor. God, I wasn't fast enough to save him. But yeah, that was the closest. This is a really cool game. I heard there's a lot of different endings. And a lot of people are kind of upset that they spent so many times on like nine different endings or something like that, instead of more on the story. But I think it's really great. Like, I, I like the whole, it's it's kind of like, um, not fast, um, the uh, Mortuary Assistant, because I've I watched that. And that's very similar to this. Like, instead of uh, uh, monitoring dead, you're at a zoo. And you know things are happening, and yeah, that that was cool though. Um, I'll definitely try this again, see if I can get a different outcome, do things differently, and yeah, good fun game though. Really enjoyed it. Yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, gonna be doing a bunch of um, scary stuff this month. Gonna try and play a bunch of horror games. I got a bunch. I got Silent Hill 2 coming out in seven days. So we can play through that. That's gonna be a long let's play. Like, I'm not gonna be cutting it down. It's gonna be like probably like hour long videos or something like that. And I'll just have like a really long series for that. Yes, it's been so long since I played the original Silent Hill 2, so I'm really excited for that. Um, but yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this game. Um, I will be doing probably a few parts to this because I want to kind of see all the animals and a lot of the different endings. I don't know if I'll do all of the endings, but we'll see. But yeah, thanks. Bye. Thank <laughs> you.